Um, currencies this morning, Australian dollars continuing to try and push up. We do need to take out um, these fibs here and then ultimately this green line to confirm. And then we're in the A of five up in the larger diagonal pattern. Still long the Australian dollar stops 72.00 on the nose. That is up to date now on the trade tables on the site. Euro, I think the four's probably in. Um, unless this is the A of four, we're going to get a B, C up to one fib higher. And that would match better with what I'm looking at in the um, uh, uh, US dollar if that is going to make another high. So we come across and look at the US dollar. Now, either the A wave is already in here at last week's high and we're getting this one, two, three right into the 1.0 extension. We need to stay below 96.76 and preferably below 96.60 and make another low um, either to the bottom of this green support region or one fib lower at 95.69. If we see that tops in in the dollar and therefore likelihood is that the bottom is in in the euro, see the retrace in the dollar and, and the, the inverse retrace in the euro and we can go long the euro dollar. Um, so that's what I'm tracking for a long entry in euro dollar there. Cable just pushing up this morning. I'm looking for this 1.0 extension on the hourly chart here for the four before we get the final fifth down. See that and hit and hold the fib and that gets me long in cable. US dollar Japanese yen it's coming down again. Um, watch 110.25 below there and I don't think this B wave over here is in um, and we're going to um, come down to the 109.28 level before we start this C of three up in the US dollar Japanese yen pair. Uh, 